What's up, people, and welcome to this video. So, in this video, guys, we're gonna go take a look at the new hero, Irethel. I'm gonna, gonna give you guys some tips and things before you're gonna buy her. And also, this is gonna be the first time for me playing her on the original server. And you've probably seen some of my videos uh, which I uploaded playing her. And you, you'll be like, well, you've already played her. What's so special about playing her on the original server? Well, it's a whole lot less buggy, okay? I will leave a link to all the gameplays down in the description if you want to check them out. But we're gonna be jumping into a game right here and we're just gonna be showing off some things. Okay, so bam, we are in the game and I just want to give you some tips before you actually go and play or buy this hero because this hero is very unique from other heroes. I definitely feel like she can potentially be an extremely good hero, okay? And the reason is why She's able to run while shooting and stuff like that. So taking like buffs or jungle monsters first the first thing I thought when I was playing her on the advance I was like this is impossible because as you can see if I'm just gonna stand here and he's gonna be attacking me She's not dealing super much damage and as you can see you're dropping a lot of health, but because she's able to move while doing this This is insane look at this I can potentially gonna kill this without taking a single hit by just running around like this, okay? But as you can see, she's still... Uh, her weak side is basically her damage uh, because um, she's not dealing that much damage, obviously, okay? So it will take a while, obviously it will take a more while, but she's able to avoid like critical hits and look at this, I'm able to run next side to him without stopping and I can use deal damage to him and I think this is gonna be so huge, so insane. We just have to wait and see, look at this. I don't have to stop, that's the thing. Look at this. Isn't that insane? In my opinion, that's amazing, okay? I can definitely see this becoming so insanely strong, it's just insane, okay? And also, she has a slow, which is even more perfect, okay? Because she's able to run around like this, she can use the slow and slow down her enemies, which is sashing her like this, and they're running slower, now they will not be able to attack her whatsoever. So I can definitely see this being able to be extremely strong, but also, because of this, you have to think about more things at the same time. You can't, you can't only be focusing on running, or only be fo focusing on, like, um, trying to attack your enemy, okay? So that is why she becomes more difficult, but she isn't, like, super difficult, definitely not. But, like, she's, she isn't definitely not one of these heroes to play. Look at this, I'm just able to slow him, and he won't, he won't even get to me, okay? It's that easy, okay? But, yeah, I'm playing against bot right now, just, just to kind of show you how it works. Oh boy, let's not go and die, man. <laughs> Easy that you can just go and hide in the bush and they will stop chasing. Really fun. Um, but like, that is one thing which you must know. And if you if you don't think you're capable like, enough to just go ahead and handle these things at the same time, I don't recommend you buying her now in the beginning. Just maybe if you're new to this game, I don't think this is here that you should start with, okay? Because you have to be thinking about... A bit of more than just one thing. Okay, now I died because I jumped in and I was stupid. But look at that, he almost died, okay? That was really stupid. I mean, I'm not, I'm not sure why the crap did I do that. Why? I'm not sure why. Okay, so like I said earlier in this video as well, is that she isn't dealing super much damage. And especially not in the beginning. And this is used in my opinion, okay? It could be different if you make another build or something like this. Right now I'm just using a, a standard build. I haven't made a build for her. Uh, you have probably seen me making some build videos for her, which I could potentially gonna use. But in this video, I, I, I just didn't make a, a, a build, I'm just playing with the normal build, okay? So, especially if she will be super strong against, like, um, like fighters and stuff like that, which can't really jump to you. You, you can just run away from them. Most likely, they will have some sort of a slow... Uh, but like you, you also have a jump and stuff like that. You, yeah, you know. But like I said, she doesn't have a super much damage. She, she isn't the best hero going one versus one. Okay, but she is extremely good at chasing because of her uh, jump ability and uh, being able to shoot while uh, running. And also, she's very good at escaping because of that same reason. Okay, now as you can see, I didn't chase because I don't. I don't even have boots. Why haven't I bought boots, man? Okay, I have boots right now. Uh, you should probably, I, I think actually, that uh, the movement speed boots are probably the best boots you can have because of her passive, okay? You just really want to embrace the passive as much as possible be, because this is why she will be strong, okay? If she will be strong, it's because she's able to run, look at this. He, even if he would want to attack me, he can't. You have to use flicker or something like that to even get close to me, okay? But as I said before, she isn't the one dealing the most damage in the game, so going one versus one is probably not that good, like going a 1 versus 1 versus another marksman, I would say that isn't that good, okay, because 
yes, you can run away from maybe the marksmen, uh, but like they will be able to shoot you as well when you're running away like this. But like they have to stop to do that. So yeah, you will most likely be able to run away if they want to attack you and stuff like that. But you know, you know what I'm talking about. One versus one standing still is a normal fight. You won't win against the marksman or maybe any other hero. Okay. Because as you can see, she isn't dealing super much damage. She is dealing damage, yes. But she's more of like an AoE damage character, okay? She's more, maybe, you should try to think of her like, um, more like a mage, I would guess. More like, more like a mage which has the capability of running, uh, being quite mobile and stuff like that. But she's, she's like, she's dealing more damage to like a group than like what she does to a single. Because look at that, you can use that to decrease the armor of the enemies, then use this to slow them down. And then you have the ultimate to deal a lot of damage to multiple people at the same time. But Gong versus one versus one. In my own opinion, I don't think she is that great at 1 versus 1, okay? Unless you're, it is like someone which can't really reach to you. Like maybe Franco, for example, if he doesn't hook me, I, I think I might be able to kite him around like this. And he won't be able to really touch me, okay? Like this. And like, yes, this is a bot, but like, you know the drill. I will be able to just try to avoid him quite much, okay? But you, you get what I mean, okay? So, what I'm trying to say is that she she will be a bit difficult to play but she will be good okay if you learn to play she will be godlike okay let's see if we will be able to kill nano right here most likely okay use inspire get the hell of much look at this this is just this is in my opinion this is so cool being able to run next to them like this and dealing damage i think that's insane i think that's so amazing okay so i'm gonna be using the use uh, showing you guys the slow as well how you can use that a bit I'm definitely not the best player at Rethel, but I've been playing her a bit on the advanced servers. I have, I have do got a bit of knowledge on her. So see, I think this guy can run around as well, right? He can, look at this. And it's insane. Then you can just run back, use the slow, look at this. <laughs> look at that. This is amazing, use that one, bam. This is amazing, isn't this amazing? I can't be the only one thing- Oh! Thinking this is amazing. <laughs> this, this, this is so insane, okay? You're able to- let's see if we can- I haven't- tried it with um, the Lord, I don't think he should be able to do that, but we can see, see if we can get him over here, he's just gonna run back, let's gonna try, please run next to the wall right here, will he keep running after me, no, okay, he runs out and run back, yeah, that's sad, let's see the crab, what range do you have, I think they have increased it, but that's not enough, but as you can see, you're able to, he, he gets one hit on me, and then I'm able to run around like this, she will definitely be stronger later game when you get a few items because you will be able to deal a lot more damage and stuff like that. You might be able to go ahead one versus one people and stuff, even though they're able to attack you at the same time. So mostly when I'm saying like one versus one, I think mostly at like you know, marksmen, okay? Because this is a marksman and stuff like that. As you can see, the damage isn't real that super high, okay? Uh, and I can hear someone drilling! Shut up! Jesus Christ! <laughs> so yeah, that's, that's about it for the video. About everything which I wanted to say, but I just want to see if uh, what jungle monster you can actually go and run around like this. You can kind of do it with this one, run here, then start running back. Look at this, and you won't take any damage whatsoever. You can do this at level one as well. Like basically, she might actually be a pretty good jungler, I guess. Let's take a look at this one. We'll probably not be able to run that far. Nope. Oh, don't run back. Okay, look at this. Okay, well you're able to run all the way down here, so it's pretty fine, I guess. Look at that. We'll take a look at this one. Let's see here. Yeah, you're able to run around with this one as well. Uh, well, I just did it earlier in this video. Let's take a look at Turtle. We'll probably not be able to run around so much with him. <laughs> so we'll be able to run out here, maybe. Oh no, okay, definitely not. Okay, but guys, that's all for this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. And I really hope some of the tips which I say, uh, said helped you out in some way. And I really hope you understand what I said. So let's try to get last kill right here you can use the ultimate I was gonna use this at the beginning this inspire slow him down let's try it look at that isn't that cool I think that's my look at that I'm running next to him okay he, he isn't able to escape because I can run at the same time let's see we have Bane here let's get the double kill let's use this first to remove his armor yes it did slow me but I'm slowed him as well now I've decided to run back good tactic bot good god that look at this get away here Slow him. I slowed me as well. Like, no, he didn't. Okay. Remove the armor. Look at that. 
<laughs> I would guess he had built some kind of an armor or something like that because he's not dealing damage whatsoever. <laughs> but he's dead. Let's take a look at that, what he built. Yeah, he did build armor. Anyway, guys, all for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it was an extra guy. But as always, thank you for watching.